Hey guys, back with you another review today. Uh, it's gonna be a little bit shorter one, but I just went to uh, the TSC stores and picked up a little tiny, uh, little, little bit smaller knife than I usually would get. This right here is the uh, Winchester. If I can focus it for you. There we go. The uh, Winchester Tactical Pocket Clip Folding Knife. Now it's a little bit smaller, as I said, smaller than some of the other knives I would get. It's about uh, two and a half inches long versus like my Gerber here, which is about three, about three and a bit. Okay, um, I've been able to use it for a couple of days now, and I've I actually quite enjoy it. Although smaller, it does have a decent size weight to it uh, for that extra, you know, insurance that you know it's in your pocket and you're uh, you're not going to lose it. So. That's a really nice feature that I like about it. And it just features right here, the um, uh, inter-handle, the lock right here. So you just compress that, press stretch that out, and the knife will just fold down. Okay, just as like that. And on the back side, it is just a standard pocket clip right here. And it is pretty good, it's, uh, it's pretty tight, so it stays on your pocket really easily. Um, the thing I do like about this though, it has, double thumb studs for ambidextrous use so if you're left or right handed this will work fine, fine for you and something I noticed about with a lot of my knives is that the thumb studs like on my Gerber thumb studs it actually becomes loose and twists a lot uh, this one I haven't had the problem with that yet it's been really really nice um, it is really cheap though it was about an $8 knife so I, was expect I wasn't expecting such good quality out of an $8 knife usually you know you get what you pay for with these kind of things but so far you know it's held up really nicely just one complaint I do have is how I don't know if you can see it on the video let's try to focus it for you alright anyways so um, uh, it's silver all along the blade right here but then as soon as you get to the serrations it's colored black so the serrations on these aren't great to begin with, and I need to sharpen them. But the problem is, if I sharpen them, it's going to look really messy with that black. If it stayed silver throughout the whole thing, when I were to uh, go to sharpen them, it would just it would look fine. But now there's going to be bits of black in it, it's just going to look really messy. I'll try to show you. Uh, yeah, right here. So see how this one, it's silver on the blade, all the way through to the serrations. So this one isn't. So I mean, it's that's not really a um, uh, kind of, I won't... It's more of an aesthetic problem with me that I like there. But other than that, you know, I don't really have any complaints about this knife. For for the price, it was about $8. It's really solid. If you're, if you're looking for a low-budget knife, you know, you can't really go wrong with this. So uh, if you just go to your uh, local TSC stores, you know, pick one up. They're about 7 or 8 bucks, And I uh, highly recommend, so far at least. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to this video.